first learned about Blood Wizard because I was a, a fan of Skinner, mm -hmm. and uh, I had seen that that was just part of that, that was just one of the projects he had worked on. I just always enjoyed, you know, his wizards and. Um, I had like a creepy, mystical feeling to it and stuff like that. I just wanted to try to take what he did, flip it a little bit, and try to make it work with the approach I take with a lot of my art. It's real symmetrical and balanced and stuff, so um, I wanted to see how I could make a wizard fit into that. And it seemed to work pretty well, and something I started doing pretty early on in um, my own personal artwork. Um, I started doing like a lot of mandalas and monsters and I think, you know, at least with monsters, multiple eyes and fangs and claws all seem to go pretty hand in hand. So uh, I was, you know, I really like Tibetan art, so like very balanced and everything. Um, and I just started throwing eyeballs in there just because take a little bit of column A and introduce it to column B and it seemed to work pretty well. Don't go on my hope for loving. 